book is very interactive. It has a so bunch of activities in it and literally a drawing board. So the idea of this book is really that you're having a conversation with people. I'd like it to be feel more of a conversation. I think the idea for me is like, it's the, it's the question I get asked the most. Right. How do you balance your life? How do you stay fit? How do you stay what healthy? Do you what do you do? You What's seem so workout? happy all the time, you know? Right. And you're like, well, I'm not always happy. I'm pretty happy. You're, <laughs> but, uh, you're but, pretty but, happy, but, Kate. But, <laughs> <laughs> but um, you know, I, I have a company, Fabletics, that is, uh, has been an amazing journey for me. I love Fabletics Thanks. so much. Thank you. It is affordable. <laughs> it is accessible and affordable. And I have been a Fabletics fan since like day one. Yeah. I'm telling you, I'm addicted to it. Thank I'm you. addicted to it. I live in I Fabletics. I am too. And I think well, you said the word accessible, and I feel like there's a there there has to be a way to have a healthy lifestyle that feels more accessible and easier to and wrap affordable. your head around and affordable and affordable than I think a lot of the things that I know even for me, you know, a, 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 a realistic approach. And so I'm trying to open the dialogue for people about how to connect with the things that they like versus the things that are sort of shoved down your throat is like the fad, which I think That's makes right. you yo-yo more. And it's really more about a, a holistic approach to connecting with yourself and, you know. And it's fun. It's conversational. I mean, yeah. it's got lines in it like, one donut, not two. <laughs> <laughs> to be real you know it's like <laughs> I, I you know I'm I, I can say I'm very healthy and I'm very active but you know at some point you know I'm gonna be on a road trip to Vegas with my girlfriends exactly and I'm gonna stop at In-N-Out Burger and and that doesn't mean that I can't also and live a very fine. healthy lifestyle and you know I yeah. like that even when it comes to the workouts it's a conversation your advice in the book is to find try a whole bunch of different sports and act Activities and find what is fun for you. Because when we get stressed, when our emotions sort of take over, motivation, activity, as everybody knows, it's so hard. It goes right out the window. It goes right out the window. You just want to stay in bed. You want to watch mindless television. But if you can connect with the thing that you love, I love to ride my bike. You know what? I'm just going to get out and I'm going to ride my bike. Emotionally, which to me is the most important, it starts to clear your head. That's why and I go in the morning. I just said the thing that motivates me is I love to go listen to loud rock music first thing in the morning. Crazy, right? But that's what gets me there. <laughs> yeah. And it makes yeah. me happy. It makes you happy. It just makes me happy. Yeah, and it's, I mean, you know, we, it's, it's hard. I think it's, a, I think it's really challenging for people. And, and, uh, and we need to support each other. And that's the other thing is to find the support systems to continue the dialogue, you know, it's okay if it's hard. It's okay if you make mistakes. Right. It's okay if you can't lose what you thought you were going to lose, uh, or what your goal was. I want to lose. I love 15. that too. So much of this is about about connecting to your body, being realistic about your body, what you can feel better about, what you can't, and, and accepting yourself and, accepting and kind. It. And, right. and and you know, we're, I think that. We're, we've got all these very beautiful images of beautiful women, you know, that 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 are at gorgeous, that are sort of shoved at us as an ideal, right. you know. Um, but I, I think that I think that it's a, a, important to kind of, instead of looking externally, is to just sort of accept each individual internally, because that that's where all of growth in any any capacity, and physical and emotional growth, happens. There are four pillars. There. There are four pillars or conversations that the book encourages you to, to have, you know, eat well and, and to move a lot and, and find the movement that makes you happy. But I think the one that I thought was most important was mindfulness, learning to, to be able to calm yourself down yeah. and to look at things in a different way. That I really owe my mom. My mom has been my, my great teacher when it comes to mindfulness and meditation. And she's sort of been at the, you know, she's been... On, on that bandwagon since the 70s, you know? And, and, and now, though, it's becoming a, 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 a real talking piece in terms of mental health and, and, and an important one. And I think everybody should have a mindfulness practice in their life.